this stupidly simple business made me over six figures in just six months. And we're talking profit too, okay? This is not sales, this is not revenue, this is take home profit. In today's video, we're gonna break down exactly what it is, how it's currently going, and how you can get started immediately today too. But first, if you're new to the channel, my name is Brian. I run an e-com company that does multiple six figures a year in profit, and I wanna help you do the same. So what is this business that we're talking about? Well, it's retail drop shipping on sites like Facebook Marketplace, okay? Now we're primarily gonna outline what this is on Facebook Marketplace because the largest portion of this profit came from Facebook Marketplace specifically, although I did a significant amount on Amazon as well. I also have done significant amounts on Poshmark and Mercari as well. And you can also interchange this uh, specifically with eBay as well and some other websites too. Each platform has different rules. So if you understand the rules, then obviously you can play on the platform. Do not take the same rules that work for Facebook Marketplace and assume that they work for drop shipping on Amazon or vice versa, right? Or any of these here. So what you're basically doing is you're taking products that are on sites like Amazon or a number of other websites. Amazon, just the easy example, because everybody uses it and that's kind of where everybody starts, right? So you're taking Amazon products, you are listing them on Facebook Marketplace, and you're all you're doing is you're marking them up for a profit. And then what happens is customers are already on places like Facebook Marketplace looking for products. When customers come and they buy your Amazon products that you've listed for more, then obviously you're going to simply send the products from Amazon to the customer and then keep the difference in profit. Now, why this works so well is that you don't need to buy products in bulk ahead of time, okay? I have a lot of e-commerce experience that's, you know, these numbers definitely aren't typical, but they're way not out of reach either. A lot of people have a lot of success on this and it's one of the easiest business models to get started, not just retail drop shipping overall, but drop shipping on Facebook Marketplace or Facebook Shops. The margins are great. You don't have to run out and buy a, a ridiculous amount of products, which ties up your cash flow and then wait for the money to come back in the form of sales. You're only purchasing a product after the customer has already paid for it and given you the money essentially ahead of time or the promise that they will give you the money ahead of time. You also obviously don't need to store products. You don't need to own a warehouse. You don't need to pay employees, although that is a way that you can scale. We'll talk about that briefly here in a second. You don't need to pay for any ad traffic to sell products, right? So we're not starting a Shopify website and then, you know, having to spend hundreds or thousands of dollars of every single month to drive traffic to that and hope that we're profitable. It also works so well because you understand how to find hot selling products and that you understand it's ultimately a numbers game. Those are the two key factors. You want to list products that are already selling well, that have a history of selling well, both on marketplace, and on other websites, the more hot selling products you list, the better your sales will be. So some key things to scale here are listing software, right? You want to build a team and you want to master cash flow and maximize profits. To break those down a little bit more specifically, listing software is, you know, there are a number of them out there. I recommend ZDrop. It's always linked in the description. All it does is it copies the title, it copies the, the pictures, and it copies the description as well as some of the specs and the specifics on certain websites and copies them over in the matter of like 10 to 15 seconds to a site like Facebook marketplace. It's an easy way to do it. It's an easy way to get started. And it takes a lot of hours and manpower out of it because the software does 95% of the work for you. And then you just have to verify a few things, publish the listing, and obviously you're off and running. Okay. The next thing is to build a team because to get to, you know, somewhere where you're actually scaled, unless you're willing to sit in front of your computer, you know, for 10 hours a day, which you very well could be. And that's totally fine. I started that way as well. Ultimately to get to high numbers, not saying you can't get to six figures, you 1000% can get to uh, six figures by yourself easily, but ultimately to scale past that and be having like 20, 30, 40 grand profit months, you're going to need a team or at least somebody that's listing for you or, and somebody that's also processing orders for you. Build a team. Any business takes a team. Any business leverages other people. Also, you want to master cash flow. Okay. So if you don't have a credit card that you can leverage or you don't have a lot of cash up front, you're going to need to scale a little bit slower and that's totally fine. But as you scale, you are going to need to master cash flow. Okay. So whether or not you keep a nest egg in a specific bank account or you have credit cards, but obviously you're going to need to spend money in this business to make money. But the key here is like, you don't need to spend money until you're promised the profit. It's a win-win, but you do need to understand cash flow 101. All right. And the next thing is maximizing profits. So once you get going, there's different, different ways to maximize profits. You ultimately want to increase your margins as much as possible. And that's not just as simple as raising your margins, right? Instead of listing at 30%, list to 60%. That can work. But what you do want to do is you want to do the little things as well, right? You want to use cashback credit cards, things like plugins like Rakuten or Honey that are going to give you extra cash back. All these things add up to your back end margin. But another thing that's that's really, really easy to do, you get tax exempt on those specific websites. Ultimately, this is super simple. Don't let anybody try to complicate it for you. Obviously, there are some key things to scale. There are some key ways to understand how to find hot selling products. And ultimately, you do need to do the work or you do need to hire somebody to do the work, right? But 
all you're ultimately doing is you're taking products either from Amazon or eBay or Walmart or Home Depot or any other retailer or any wholesale supplier as well, and you're listing them with software on, on places like Facebook Marketplace for a higher price. Then the next step is you're waiting for somebody to buy them. Then you're sending them the original listing from wherever you listed it from. And again, that software will store your listings and you can search for them. And then you're keeping the net profit for yourself. And then ultimately it's just rinse, repeat. And scale. Now, anybody can start this, like I said, and make money today. I am not special. I promise you I'm not special. I do have some e-commerce experience over the past decade. Obviously, that helps. I'd be lying if I tell you it didn't. But ultimately, I'm pretty hands off now. I went out. I learned everything about this business. I wasn't even drop shipping like seven, eight months ago. I literally had just started it. But ultimately, I'm pretty hands off now, and I have a team that runs the business for me. I also, I don't have any secrets. Okay, there's no secrets to the, this business. You need to list better products. You need to list more products. It's ultimately that simple. So if you want a step by step blueprint to your own six figure drop shipping business on Facebook. Facebook Dropship Pro is linked directly in the description. All right, please give this video a thumbs up too if you appreciate and got any value from it whatsoever. I genuinely appreciate it. And also, if you want a beginner's tutorial that will take you through the process of actually listing products on Facebook Marketplace with the software that I referenced, the tutorial linked up in the right hand corner right now is a perfect place to start. All right, that will take you from everything from A to Z and get you started today. All right, so I hope that that helps, and I'll see you in the next one.